Hi, my name is Robert from UBL Themes. Today's tutorial is going to be regarding installing the Porter theme for your WordPress. When you download, that name will be uh, a generated theme forest file, a zip file. Open that. Within there, you should have three zip files, not the two which you can see on mine, but you should have a licenses, a theme, and a help document. Open the theme. Within it, you should have two themes UBL Porter zip file and the UBL Porter child theme zip. So if you have any alterations you want to do CSS or any type of programming um, I would highly recommend using the child theme after you've installed the main theme that is um, purely because any future updates which will come in the UBL Porter won't wreck your customizations. So as you can see it's a brand new theme just install purely for this tutorials and you go to appearances I've already uploaded them to make the tutorial quicker but um, to upload the, the themes go to add new upload theme and upload your themes then activate them always activate well you will only be able to activate the uh, portal WordPress theme first from there you should get a message saying begin installation of the plugins and then just install. You'll get a message telling you it's installed and to go back to the installer. Um, don't worry about that message. That there is because I'm plugging I'm using to try and get this to work a little bit faster because my internet connection is bad. So that's not actually to do with our plugin or our theme. So once you've installed that, you'll need to activate your child theme in case you want to do any alterations in the future and your child theme is now active now if I refresh you'll see that you've got the basic design the only thing that's missing is the menu so click on menus create a menu and then make sure it's set to primary and then from there your theme is now installed um, the next tutorial is going to be regarding the customizer which is this menu here and all these lovely things on what they do um, and also it will make it will show you how to do the footer the header etc etc so I'll see you in the next tutorial